Okay, we got SAO Abridged Parody Episode 14. Let's go. <laughs> Jeez, no! where, where's uh, these guns at? Bye oh, bye. Wow, you're not even gonna wait now, are you? <laughs> Normal voice. Normal voice. <sighs> now that I've shaken the rust off, won't you come on down here and show me some of that southern hospitality, Colonel? Come on down, boy. You've had a working set of wings now, don't you? Yeah, come you? up here. Come Why don't on. Don't you mosey your inferior little behind up here, and we'll settle this like fairies. That was pretty. Good until you know he was pretty pretty. He's trying to fucking act like hard ass. <laughs> yeah, we'll settle this like fairies because it's a fucking super hot Winnie Junior game, dude. And up here, and we'll settle this like fairies. Um, no, yeah. I'm, I'm good. I don't want to waste my time flying up there and then coming back down to dig your grave. Oh my dear muffin, can you not fly? Goodness. Sometimes you can. I know you springins were a garbage Jesus. race, but I had no idea you were impotent. <laughs> now, I just connected the dots. Are these salamanders specifically right now, they're all having a southern accent, right? These guns, Keith, General Panty Smasher 69. They're all like southern accent. But on top of that, they're obviously a racist. Because it's a racist fairy game. Kitty 2 is also black pretty gun but like they're intensely all southern accents to further imply that you know this is a fucking racist game i, I was like i didn't because like yes there was casual racism like you spriggans but i'm like wait hold up a second hold up a second this is a fucking southern accent now this isn't to generalize and say all southern people are racist no that's not what i'm saying but there is that kind of stereotype right asian people good at math southern people doesn't like spriggans i don't know <laughs> And there's more where that came from, Sanders. Next one won't be a warning shot. Colonel but Sanders. I'm a gracious man. What do you prefer? Wing or thigh? Wing. <laughs> Wing or thigh? Uh, uh, it'd be easier if it was thigh or breast. I like thigh. Breast is like, um, I don't know. It's, it's just, the thigh is just a drumstick thigh, thermal thigh, it's so easy to eat, right? But the breast is like, you gotta fucking move it around, it's, I don't know. But then the wings and the thighs. The wings are fucking great though. Oh, fuck, I don't know. I might have to go with the wings. I, I think I might have to go with the wings, and yes, we're fucking talking about food, you degenerates. No, I think not, Spriggan. I don't know what sort of arrangement you degenerates have made with the sylphs. But know this, hmm? the salamanders cannot be stopped, and we shall not rest until we have that booty. That booty. <laughs> Wait. Did he, did 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 he just turn into a pirate at the end? What was that? We have what that booty? That booty. Wait, would Panty Smasher say booty? Would he? Yeah, you're. No, of course he. Would. He, Panty Smash is not a pirate, but a booty? You guys have thrown me Emerging off my ruins. whole rhythm! You're just impossible to play off of! You know what? Enjoy the ground! Later, casuals! Goodbye, roleplay. <laughs> Joke's on him. I only had the one sword. <laughs> which I now have to go find. Shoot. No, go talk shoot. to your sister, bro. Why the fudge did I say shoot? Fudge! I don't, I don't know. Oh my god, fish! What's wrong with me? I don't no, know what's sir. going on. Are you a newcomer to our realm? Have you not heard tell of the en the enchantment placed upon this island which halts the forbidden tongue? It's a roleplay server. You gotta roleplay. You're breaking character. Come on, play with it. Cheese and crackers, you're still roleplaying? Please, lady, I am begging you. Just talk to me like a person for two seconds! No. Dude, it's a kid's game. There's a profanity filter. Oh! I want to go home. That's why you were saying fudge and shit like that. I just realized, because like, it is kind of reiterated over and over that it's a fucking, you know, children's fucking, you know, Weenie Hut Jr. game. <laughs> I hate this! 
is? This place is dumb. I can't even curse. What? Well, on TikTok, you also can't really curse, right? TikTok actually has a much heavier moderation tools compared to YouTube or any other platform that I've been creating content on, man. I, the amount of moderation there is crazy, but that actually leads to innovation. Kids are starting to realize they can't just type out slurs. So what do they do? Instead of saying autistic, they'll say acoustic, acoustic, right? Instead of saying retarded, they'll say regarded, right? So when I see these comments, and sometimes I read the TikTok comments and I'm like, what the fuck does regarded mean? I'm like, oh, oh, oh I, I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. Profanity filter, you can put it in its place, but human innovation is always going to adapt around it. What kind of nightmare is this? <laughs> Do not cry, filthy spriggan. You mustn't show weakness before the Okay, you filthy sylph. Why does everyone keep calling me filthy? Those brigands you killed still linger for a time. They are a crafty bunch. Plotting and scheming their schemes, schemes and, plots. and plots. Hey, so what was all that stuff about a a, a prophecy? Oh, is there it, one? It's just some secret backstory stuff I came up with. You were supposed to be some like chosen one who'd lead the salamanders to glory. <laughs> this feels like a fucking D and D campaign where they're just fucking you know bringing up random fucking shit out of nowhere, and other people have to just adapt to it. But then. Once you rose to power, you'd urge us to abandon our violent ways and embrace a culture of love and art and veganism. Boo, veganism. Now, no disrespect to my vegans. You want to be vegans, be vegans all you want, but I'm going to eat my shmeat, though. Oh, wow. Well, uh, that uh, sounds like it would have been... But then, it had turned out that I'm super not about that life. So in the dead of night, i sneak into your kingly abode, and you'd wake up just in time to see me drive the knife into your chest. I'm getting really into this, this. this. This look of heartbreak and betrayal on your face. And yeah. I'm crying, because I'm killing my best friend. But I know it has to be done for the good of this He's side. really getting into it. And I think you kind of get that right at the end, because just before you pass on, we make this beautiful eye contact. There's no judgment there. You know I'll already hey, be yo. judging myself enough. You don't want to add to that burden. So you just shoot me this understanding nod. And as the light leaves your eyes, you die in my arms. And I realize all too late that you truly were the leader we needed all along. Do I smell a fucking coup? General Panty Smasher is getting revolted on by fucking these guns and Keith. And scene. Listen, Dylan. My mom said Dylan. pizza bagels already. I don't think we should see each other again. What? Oh, come <laughs> I think Keith just realized that Dylan's trying to fucking uh, do some sussy shit. So, all right. I'm, I don't want to talk to you ever again, bro. I don't roll that way, bro. Oh, this is a little role play. You made it weird. weird. No, you made Trevor. it weird. All right. Trevor! I cannot believe his name was actually Trevor. But his fucking game name was Keith. Well, Keith is supposed to be like a stereotypical southern name, right? All right. We can speak now. Now what do you want? Well, just how you treat everyone who saves you? I can just feel the gratitude radiating off of you. Like a warm summer breeze wafting across the meadow. The Bambi's mom was shot in. Spoilers! You, change? you people always begging for change. No, no, I'm good. Really just kind of curious What about kind of change what? are you talking about? What the Why? fuck? Fine! Just take it and go! Look, lady, I just want to ask... Is she? You people always want change. Throws coins at us. She, 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 she talking like we want to abolish slavery, and she's seeing us like a homeless person and throwing coins. Is that the role play that's going? On? Is is is? Yo, uh, where's Asna at? Asna, Asna would enjoy this. Asna would lead the charts with this fucking roleplay. It's not even roleplay for her, actually. It's it's not even roleplay for Asna. But sorry, the Grand Wizard is stuck in the birdcage right now. You about the Forget her, Daddy. No. We do not have time to deal with this obstinate hussy. If you get in our way, I will. You eat will what? Not the time. Who is this now? Doug, this is Yui. It's my She's pocket my, uh, um, pocket pixie. Pet? Yeah, that's a super rare drop. Hmm. You claim to be new to this game, yet your stats are so high you were mm. able to kill two high level players in as many attacks and have a super rare pet item to boot. He's a beater! None of this adds up. So tell me, what's your game? 
Spriggan. Well, I mean... Alfheim. Alfheim, I guess? Uh, not like that, <laughs> literally. <laughs> what a laugh, oh, dude. How delightfully droll! Oh, you're an amusing one, stranger! Bye, this, game. this is basically the English equivalent of the Ojo Sama laugh, huh? It's actually, actually this, this, this like, this, like, uh, non-Japanese Ojo Sama accent is pretty good. Please. Pleased to make my acquaintance. Don't you mean your? I know what I said. No, you don't. Well, bow! No! Yeah, that's gonna be a hard pass. Yui, you ready to get this show on the road? I don't think we're getting anything useful out of Barbie Warrior Princess. Yes! Barbie wait, wait. Warrior Princess? Wait, wait. Sorry. Oh, oh, oh see. Don't go. Out of character. And you thought? Sorry about the role playing. I'll drop Yui. it for a while. People around here get kind of intense about it, you know, so I just I try to stay in character as much as I can. Thanks for the assist with those guys back there, by the way. In character. I think you said you role play, questions. sure. Yeah, you could say. I think she's just secretly racist and this is a way to express it. That, I was hoping you could explain a few things about this game, especially the tree. Oh, you mean the world yeah, tree. The math tree. What? Exactly. Wait, the what? What? Gather round, children, and test your numerical might against my mystical equation. This is turned into Misfit of Demon King Academy Season 2. Remember the talking tree? Each one designed to stupefy the mind and All right, mental math soul. time? Begin! If two plus two! Uh, two plus two! Uh, three! Yeah. Okay. I do definitely have some questions about that, but I kind of meant, you know, that one. Yeah, that's right. Oh, real. you mean the world tree. Yeah. Sure, I can tell you all about it. Why don't we go... What the fuck was the point of the math tree? What kind of lore or kind of like reference is that? I don't know. That's very intentional, but like math tree. Movie reference? Inside joke? Kids game. Kids games have those kind of fucking games? Now that I think about it, back when I was in like elementary school and we go to the computer lab, there was like these fucking, there were math games. There were these fucking math games to make it fun. I never liked them. I just fucking played RuneScape instead. It was somewhere a little more comfortable though. This place is crawling with salamanders and they've been gunning for me a lot lately for some reason. Come on, I know a killer bar over in Sylvain. Bar? I thought this yeah, was a kid's milk. game. It's gonna yeah, be fucking lame cool ass. kid's game. What, what kind of bar go. is it? We're gonna be drinking milk there. Uh, hey now, what's the rush? Why don't we just take a nice moonlit stroll through the forest full of sexual predators and weird trees? Can't fly, bro? Time grows short, children. Give me thy answer now, or be forever cursed. To oh my gosh! Naked. Wander naked. Are you sure this is a children's game? Are you sure this is a children's game? Er, what? Impossible! No! He answered my riddle. Yeah, Plus you're five not VXP. fooling anybody, champ. Turn around, pop your wings. Okay, so there's this little trick that I like to use. Uh, Block your yeah? back muscles. Uh, what's that? Think happy thoughts! <laughs> <laughs> it worked somehow. Uh, uh oh. Hey, dude! Are you okay? It would have been funnier if there was like a cliff and you know she just pushed them off. You know how like birds like when they're trying to fly, they're easy to fucking push it. Out. It's like come on, survive. This is amazing! Wow, you're doing great! It took me six months to get that good. Get good. That's fine. Noob. Now Women I know gamers. it's your first time, so I'll be gentle. Oh, don't worry about me. My wife punches me during sex. Was there punching in, in, in the bridge? Just trying to think. Did I, did I, did I, I, I can believe it in the abridged version, but I'm just trying to think. Did she actually punch him? Was there some violence in the bed? I can't remember right now. Or holy fuck, it might have actually did happen. Because he mentioned Rosalia. That's right. We were deep in her. And then we said, and then we were, and then, and then Kito was getting angry because Rosalia said, this is the deepest you'll ever be in a woman. And he says, take that, Rosalia. And the ass was like, who? All right. 
uppity noob, thinking he can outdo me? Doing flies faster than the princess of Sylph. Son of a beast! What's the Slow. matter, princess? Tired already? Oh, I mean, eat my farce! Oh, eat my farce. Not very posh of you. All right, let's land at the bottom of this tower here. Land? What do you mean, land? You never told me how to land. <laughs> Oh, what? But you're so confident. I thought you knew everything about flying with your five minutes of experience. Doesn't he just Get run into this building? Please. It's getting closer. Don't worry. It's real easy. All you've got to do is... Yeah? Emma, what was that? I didn't Bop. catch it. Princess! <laughs> Aside from the girly laugh, the stream there. The whole, like, this is straight up, yeah, this is straight up 912. But, like, in, in the SAO proper anime, what happened? Like, we're trying to get in here, but we're trying to be discreet, right? Because it's like self territory, you know? We don't take too kindly to your spriggans around here. So it's like, we're trying to, like, secretly go in there, make sure we don't cause trouble. But Leafa just, like, doesn't even help. And fucking just makes Kiritsu just crash into a fucking building, bro. Hello? So has the little Spriggan learned his place? You're just uh, mad that we're fast no, as you. But I have developed a very sudden yet powerful distrust of the monarchy. Oh, you peasants are always saying that. Let me fix you right up. See spot, see spot, run, run spot, run. Inter <laughs> what the fuck was that incantation? Interesting incantation. Can a Spriggan learn that kind of thing? Oh, you can try, but your kind are far more adept at lying and stealing. Excuse me? Yeah, illusion magic and treasure hunting. Uh, okay. That is not okay. what you said. Hey, princess! Rickon! Oh, butterscotch. It's one of my oh, friends. Oh, it's butterscotch here, okay. Don't judge me, but I'm about to go deep. What? Deep what? How? My dear Rickon, what brings you before my royal countenance this fall? Fine evening. Oh, not much. How's it hanging, Leafa? Gosh darn it, Reckon! You're making me look bad in front of the Spriggan! Oh. No, you make yourself look bad. Oh, oh gosh. I'm sorry, Princess. I didn't mean Roleplay, to- Roleplay, come on! Oh, Frack! A Spriggan! Uh, you've got some nerve coming into our territory! Racist children's uh, game! Do you want me to kill it, Princess? No, no, it? not this time, Reckon. It? He- Not this time?! Is one of the good ones. Four years ago. Damn. They be fucking making jokes like this in 2020, bro, huh? Like, that's pushing it. Like, these jokes are fucking, you know. <laughs> I, I, it is satire, but like, <laughs> some of the things that they're saying is very, you know, <laughs> um, racially charged, right? To the Spriggans. And what, what are the Spriggans supposed to represent in real life, right? Damn, they've been saying this shit in 2020. That's fucking wild, bro. Gee, thanks. Oh, really? Awesome. Well, any friend of the princess is a friend of mine. My name's Rick. Leafa, Leafa, what's happening? What the fuck? Oh, gosh, she's crushing my hand. Uh, yeah, that's just his nerve here. What, he what happened? He one off the parents of one of those dead SAO kids. <laughs> the parents were auctioning off the nerve gear? That's fucked up. That is fucked up. Dude. Every now and then it kind of... Does this, yeah. It? Pulses the fear center of his brain. Hey, he's already getting the uh, asana treatment. You know, the slugs? You remember the slugs in Oberon's little lab where with all the fucking brains, bro? He's got the tentacle monster already. Apparently, he got it pretty cheap, though. What with it having melted their son and all. <laughs> oh, yeah, nice. nice. Hopefully, they cleaned it. You're That's okay, an assassination Reckon. class in reference? Now. Haven't seen it. Deep breath. Holy cow, are you okay? Why would you keep using that thing? Because he's broke. Oh, it's not that bad. Sure, being randomly ambushed by my deepest fears isn't ideal. But you, you take the good with the bad, you know? What's the good? I got this thing for $600, and all I had to do was... That is fucking expensive. 600 for a fucking used one that was faulty? But then again, how much is like the Apple Vision Pro? Isn't that shit like 3,000 or 4,000 fucking dollars, right? I mean, and this nerve gear technology is way more advanced, so I could believe it. In the brains out of it. Um, dude, those things were $500 new. He got scammed. Well, it's like a special version, because, you know, their kid died. So, like, it's like a special nerve gear. It's a $100 tax. Come on now. 
The brain bits. Well, hundred extra dollars. I, I mean, they were grieving. They, they probably weren't thinking about the math too much. I bet they you were. Too precious. For I bet they world. were, bro. Anyway, uh, princess, are you heading to your engagement party soon? I know it's supposed to be fashionable engagement. to be a little late, but everybody's looking With for who? you, and the band's been playing your intro music for Sigurd. Well, for about five hours now. Oh, uh, Potimas. Uh, uh, swear to gosh. Uh, <laughs> Exhausted band plays a medieval cover of the Cascadas every time we touch. Don't stop playing. I'll have your nuts in a vice. Oh yeah, I totally <laughs> forgot. Yeah, I'm not going to that. I promised this rando I'd tell him about the game. Yeah, why? What? But princess, if I come back empty-handed, Prince Casimir will hunt me like a common cat, see? Prince Casimir, who is Sigurd, why is it named Prince Casimir in the um, abridged, ref uh, abridged version? What is a reference of Prince Casimir? That's a name that I'm not familiar with because I am uh, unenlightened in the media tropes that they like to visit. You're making people sad, Reckon. We're leaving. Whoa, wait. Uh, all right. I understand. Bye, Reckon. So, the princess is engaged, I see. Only in the game. Jeez. Uh, hey, that counts for something. But uh, you don't seem too into the idea. You maybe got eyes for someone else? Maybe someone your royal family could never approve of. Well, the royal family is into incest, right? Traditionally, back in the day. So I think they would approve of the Kirito Sugu relationship. Yui also looks very cute here. Like, like a strapping young farmhand. Or perhaps you like him sweet and scrawny. Like, like that Reckon boy. One time! Did you tell your brother how's this gonna work out? How 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 is this gonna work out in the wait wait when this is when 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 is the revelation? The revelation happens in episode twenty two, right? The revelation happens in episode twenty two in the official version, and there's a bridge up to episode seventeen. So the abridged version episode seventeen should cover when Leafa figures out that Kirito is actually the older brother, and then she's gonna revisit this moment and then be like. Shit, I told my big brother that I fucked up Recon and <laughs> in the game. Whoa, what? I believe she's using a colloquial term to refer to the- <laughs> Yes, Yui, I know, I know, I know. I know what she means, Yui. We're not dating or anything. It was- it was for a quest. What Shut kind of up! fucking quest for cards are to fucking blow for... Recon? <sighs> Forget it. I have neither the time nor- You know what? Dub Recon. A bridge reckon is more giga chat than anime reckon so far. In the anime, he does a, he has a very cool moment in the world tree where he uses the dark magic and you know has a self suicide moment, right? But yeah, kids game by the way, kids kid races kids game where a fucking quest requires you to fucking orally stimulate. Or the inclination to navigate the tangled web of politics and hormones that is your love life. Inclination? What are you trying to say? That my love life's a mountain? You saying I climb mountains like some jack booted lesbian? Princesses don't climb mountains. Mountains climb princesses. What does oh, that, that mean? Boy. What so, does that anyways? Things that are tall, a world tree. Discuss. All right, you were asking about that. Eh, sure. You got me out of that party, so I guess I owe you one. I also saved you from those enemy players. I mean, yeah, but what have you done for me lately? I, I got you out of your engagement party. Oh, that's right. All right, yeah, I'll tell you all about it. Okay, we have but a reason for Leafa to, to help. That, I'm gonna need to fill you in on some background info. Okay. For you see, long ago. No. Okay, that was so Skyrim. Like six that was Skyrim. Ago, a group of nine friends found this game in like a bargain bin or something. It was supposed to be for kids, but nobody's parents were letting them play it for some reason. I don't know. Old people are always freaking out about something. Like the SAO disaster? Sure, but I mean, like, get over it, right? So anyway. That perfectly summarizes how nonchalant people are. It's picking up, even just like using their own nerve gear to play Alfheim online. Because I'm like, damn, 10,000 people get stuck in, 6,000 roughly fucking die because of this crazy incident where you die in game, you die in real life. 
and people are still down to play the fucking VR MMO. And you got people like fucking Reckon buying used nerve gear off of the parents whose child died. And the parents themselves are fucking reselling it at higher than the fucking market rate. These friends figured what the that fuck it is going on? perfect place for their role playing. And seeing the wide variety of playable mm. races, they decided the stage was perfectly set for a campaign they dreamt of since they were children. Children. These children are fucking vile, bro. This per is that the perfect state? The children were always thinking about this like racially fucking charged fairy game. Race war. Yeah, race war. Not listening. Yep. Tastes like shirt. <laughs> we all what? know it's shit. Yep. T we all know it's shit. Tastes like shirt. Tastes like shirt. <laughs> Anyways, you were saying? What? You see, what? rumor has it that the first race to get to the top of the world tree will have any wish they want granted by the Fairy King, Oberon. So naturally, whoever wins that race wins the war. Cool. Race war. Hashtag race war. <laughs> there's, a, there's, a, there's a really funny moment. I'm not sure. There's a, there's a clip of a guy who's like, the, his native language is not English, right? Is it a streamer? And, um... Basically, his, his streaming is, um, uh, there's a couple different stories I could go with this, but he, he's basically a, like a, a driver, right? He, 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 he drives, that, that, he, he plays driving games like Gran Turismo and stuff, right? And, and, and someone asked, someone asked, what is your uh, favorite, favorite race, <laughs> right? Somebody, somebody, somebody asked, what is your favorite race? <laughs> and, and you can kind of tell where we're going with this, right? I think I might be getting the stories mixed up. I, I think there was a, another, another person. I don't know. No. Okay, I have two separate stories. The first one is someone asked, what is your favorite race to somebody? And, you know, they get baited by saying, oh, well, I'm white. So I'm going to say white. And I said, no, I, I meant the, your favorite, you know, fucking, you know, bicycle race throughout the last something year. And then there's another story where the driving, you know, fucking streamer guy, someone asked, um, I think he was talking about like, um, what it means to be like, 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 for example, if you're like a flower person, then you're a florist, right? If you're, uh, if you're a fucking, what, 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 what other stuff is there, right? Something IST, right? If, you, if you're like a, someone that studies biology, you're a biologist. Me? I'm a racist. Because he races on his fucking driving Gran Turismo game, but he doesn't speak natural English. So he said... Oh shit! No, no, I'm not an actual racist! Anyways, oh, the best racist Brugans. Oh, okay. I mean, I can't believe you call it that, but I guess that's not as bad as- There's also been quite a bit of racial violence. A lot. Oh, Princess Leva! We got this Self one. little scamp crossing the border and we're having ourselves a good old-fashioned fox hunt! You simply must join us! Scamp? Fox hunt? Did they find us Brigan? Are they- is, are these keywords for something specific? Are, are, are these dog whistles? I got a fox! I'm a cat sick! Cat sick. They're hunting cat sick. Oh, doesn't he just make the most delightful little sound? Yo, the souls are <laughs> fucked <laughs> up! <laughs> what does the fox say indeed? That's an old <laughs> fucking joke. <laughs> and, uh, there's a car? There's a car in this oh, game? What does the fox say? They're, they're, they're playing that fucking song. Right Crank that jam! That is Wait, my noise! Is that a car? Yeah, it's a oh, car. Yeah, totally. It's like an epic level mount or something. Oh. I hear at the top cool. of the world tree, there are mounts like that as far as the eye can see. Like some majestic used car dealership of the gods. What? Okay, but how does one get to the top of the world tree? Fly. Fly. Crayola kerfuffle is fascinating and all, but that's really the only part I care about. Huh? Crayola oh, for fuffle. Children's what? battles. Yeah, man. Nobody does. If we knew that, somebody would have already won the war. Consarnet! Huh? Huh? Consarnet? Daddy. I finished my cracker. May I have another cracker? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Sorry, don't mind me. I'm just... <laughs> what was I say with you? <laughs> I finished my cracker. I finished my cracker. May I have another cracker? Sure. 
sorry. There, there's nothing racially charged here with the term cracker right now, right? Don't I, me. I honestly don't know. Are they being intentional with these? Am I reading too deep into it? Are they still caring with the racist jokes? I don't know. I'm just kind of in a rush to get up there. Okay. My but wife. Why? It's just a game, man. My wife's up don't there. Worry about it. Thanks for all the help, but this isn't your problem. Oh. Bye bye. Uh, I'll just have to find someone with a bit more experience. More experience. <gasps> oh wait, 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 wait! Role plays back. He's just basically upset because it's like we don't know how to fucking climb up the tree, and she didn't have the fucking answer. Dare you? Huh? Do you really believe you'll find a more capable ally than me? Well, let's get serious. Leafa was actually very useful, right? Well, no, actually, no, no. I, I'll take that back. It's not Leafa that's useful. It's her fucking sword that's useful. Two key moments where Kirito starts dual wielding. Maybe Eugene is more useful than Leafa, but 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 I feel like Leafa's sword is a lot more useful than Leafa herself. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I may not know exactly how to conquer that tree. And sure, everyone who's tried has met a gruesome end. But I am Princess Flippin Lee. Flippin, <laughs> language filter. And if there's one thing I do know, it's how to throw wave after wave of loyal subjects at a problem until they either figure it out for me or yeah. their corpses stack up so high they'll ring Oberon's doorbell. That's a terrible because way to rule. That, good sir, is how a princess do. <laughs> nice so, role play. You wanna come with? <laughs> you bet your sweet patootie I'm coming with. You two wouldn't last a day without me. <laughs> sweet patootie? Honestly, Welcome she wouldn't last a day without us. Fair warning. If you slow us down for even an instant, I shall not hesitate to leave you for the wolves. So it's decided. We shall embark on a noble quest on the morrow when the sun crests the highest peak of Mount Sugar Plum. This now, roleplay I language is so fucking dedicated. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Sugu time. Duh, I forgot to mention. My name's Kirito, by the way. Yeah, Kirito, yep. Not Kazuto, Kirito. You don't know that name, what? though. You don't know I that said name. My name's Kirito. You don't Sorry, know that name. I forgot to introduce myself earlier. Leafa doesn't know, right? Oh, okay. Bye. It seems like Leafa does know in the abridged. Did 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 I miss something in the abridged episodes? Did Kirito actually announce the Kirito? Maybe not, but maybe it's like in the abridged version, it's different. But I'm just trying to think like back in the couple episodes ago, episode fourteen and thirteen. Did and and maybe even twelve. Did she? Pretty sure they publicized Kirito being a hero in their bridge? Really? Even in SAO proper, Oberon, you know, he knew of Kirito's name. It's like, oh, the hero Kirito, right? Okay, Sugu, how do you know this? Ah! Son of a horse, dead fucking shit, weasel, fucking bitch, whore! Yes! No profanity filter here. What is that fucking cock sampler doing in my game? Cock? Sampler. That's a great. That's <laughs> cocksucker is like pretty. Yeah, cocksucker is like it's pretty old, right? Not very innovative, but cock sampler. Now we're getting creative. Oh, Jesus fuck! I said yeah, you sweet patootie. Sweet patootie. <laughs> Very interesting twist, though, huh? In the abridge, she already knows, so we don't have to wait for the disastrous ending. Also, she should almost immediately know now. I told my big bro that I sucked off Recon in the game. Now we don't have to wait till episode 17. Anya, I swear, you grow more beautiful by the day. Oberon. Captivity suits you well. Ew. What do you want, Sugo? Now, now, I keep telling you. In Why is Sugu and Sugo's name so fucking close? They're just off by one letter. Huh? They're just... I don't know. This is interesting to me. This is that intentional? This world, I am to be addressed as Oberon. The Oberon. King. And I keep telling you, it's pronounced Oberon. Oberon. You know, like moron. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Always so... Oberon. I think oh, it is pronounced Oberon. 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 Quick with that tongue of yours. I do so wish you would put it to better use. Cock sampler. <laughs> <laughs> the shuddering animation. All I've done for you. 
I've made you my queen, draped yeah. you in fineries, given you this wonderful wow. cage. I ask you, what more could you possibly freedom. want? Freedom. My freedom! Oh, the petty gripes of a woman. Freedom's Do not petty gripes? Forget, my dear, that I am king of this world. Your consent is strictly a courtesy. So Ew! If you don't start playing along. Ew! I'm afraid I'll have no choice but to. Ah! Oh! <laughs> you know what? <laughs> She's to I'm not in the mood. Go on and struggle all you want while you still can. Your tune will change soon enough. Oh, I don't know. I've been here two months and I have yet to cave to my womanly urges. It's been real touch and go so far, but I think I could go the distance. <laughs> You know, my dear, have I ever told you what an excellent investment the SAO servers were? Hmm. That Kaiaba, well, he's oh, lore? Lore? Step four. Seven was undeniably a genius. Why, once we ironed out the last of his unfortunate little bugs, building Alfheim of the bones of SAO was practically child's play. You're making it sound like you actually developed, but I thought it was just copy paste that he's making it sound too good. It really was a fascinating game. A true pioneer in the field of VR. You can't even imagine the breakthroughs we've had just by studying its code. Studying, really? For instance, you didn't just copy paste. Was actually able to scan in your real life abilities and assign your base stats accordingly, allowing one to rise up from. Is this true in the SAO property? No, I shouldn't take a bridge lore seriously. I'm just thinking how that kind of lines up with Kirito having the fastest reaction speed, and then you know, therefore, it's like, oh, you get dual wield as a unique skill. And their former self. Into a hero of legend. Yeah, true, I was huh? trapped in that world for two years. You really think I didn't know all that? Well, I just find it fascinating is all. Increase your strength stat, and even a child could wield the mightiest weapons. Increase dexterity, and you could move with the grace of a world-class gymnast. Increase charisma. Yeah, yeah, Chris, it would let And you me... should seduce women? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh-oh. By Jove, I think she's got She's it. got the Riz yes. unique skill? With a high enough charisma stat, even the most asinine suggestion becomes impossible to refuse. Honestly, this kind of power is, like, what I would be super into, right? I, like, I, I think of all Isekai characters, Kazuma, I might align with the most. Because, like, I'm not strong. I'm not fast. All I'm good for is fucking yapping. But sometimes, yapping is enough. And with yapping, a quote-unquote silver tongue, you can convince people to ally up with you and kind of work for you and kind of do all that stuff. The charisma stuff, I don't know. I, I feel like, again, if I was ever in an RPG, I would, like, min-max, right? If I was in solo leveling, there isn't, like, a luck stat, but they'd be always in, like, luck, speech. Charisma. Like these kind of stats, I think is the most fascinating, and that's why I love one trick ponies. The fact that that's even possible speaks volumes about the wasted potential of that device. To think he had the power to bend the masses to his will, and he just gave it to a bunch of greasy imbeciles. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So, there is some key to moments, right? With this high enough charisma stat, even the most asinine suggestion becomes impossible to refuse. It becomes impossible to refuse. Okay. The fact that that's even possible speaks volumes about the wasted potential of that device. Okay. Think he had the power. We're talk are we talking about Kirito right now? The fact. Charisma hat! Charisma hat! Charisma hat! It's 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 it's, 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 it's oh fuck. The charisma hat. What the f holy shit? We're going, we're going full circle. We're, we're, look at the hat. Look, 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 look at the hat. Look at the hat. Look at the hat. The, the hat was there for like a couple fucking episodes. And it was gone. Right? We threw it away, I think, in a... We gave it to Balls Deep. Balls Deep still has it? I don't know. A high enough charisma stat, even the most asinine suggestion becomes impossible to refuse. The fact that that's even possible speaks volumes about the wasted potential of that device. To think he had the power to bend the masses to his will. He just gave it to a bunch of greasy imbeciles begging for nudes. Truly, we cannot be. <laughs> Wait, so I guess we didn't give it to Kaiba. I'm, I'm thinking about something else, right? I, I think Balls Deep, we gave like a resurrection stone, right? This, so this guy, Lore, Lore, a bridge Lore specifically, we gave it to fucking one of the. Is this the house guy? Asking for nudes. Are they all asking for Sachi's nudes? Is that the implication here? The fucking. The Black Cat Guild? Like. It was even Gary asking for nudes? Talking about Kaba making the item. 
but we're also talking about this person with the charisma hat. More people had hats. And he's asking greasy nerds asking for nudes. So the implication is there's multiple people. There's multiple people here. There is the charisma hat. And here's one girl. So logically, one could then conclude, oh, this is the people that asked for nudes from Sachi. Right? Possible to refuse. The fact that that's even possible speaks volumes about the waste of He went to get his fucking house device. and then he jumped off the to bridge. He had the power to bend the masses to his will. And he just gave it to a bunch of greasy imbeciles yes. begging for nudes. Kaiba's the one that had it. And he gave it to the cat gang who were the greasy imbeciles. Best begging for Sachi nudes. Truly, we cannot begin to understand the mind of such a madman. Quite right, my precious flower. But I shall not squander this power like he did. Okay. When all those players were being logged out, I made sure to snap up a few as test subjects. Your beautiful. That's right, they're all stuck in the lab. Thanks to their noble contribution, my men will have perfected this technology by week's end, and I shall hold the world in the palm of my hand. So in a bridge, Oberon's ultimate goal is to make use of this unique, uh, unique asset of SAO. And he basically wants to recreate the charisma hat for himself. Is that, is that what's implied here, right? He wants enough charisma so he can convince Asuna to do whatever she wants for him. That's what's going on here, right? But more importantly, we'll be rid of that rebellious streak of yours. Just in time for you to walk down the aisle. Technically, she's bedridden. You would make a comatose person? How would that work? I'm just thinking about the wedding in the hospital, walking down the aisle. Would he pick up Asna's fucking body and just like drag it to like symbolize like walking through the aisle? You're insane! <laughs> Thankfully, you're also an idiot. Why would you tell me any of this? You really think I'm just gonna sit around and wait for that to happen? Because he's a cliche villain. <laughs> oh, my dear Titania. You're lucky you're so pretty. By all means, give me your best shot. But if you really think you can overpower the system admin, then I dare say you're even dumber than I am. And know? she's gone. Oh, she made a run for it. Oh, Alice is killing them all. Alice is killing them all. Oh. That's it. All right. That's today's episode. An interesting twist. How... Oh. Sugu actually knows who Kirito is, so we kind of skip all this, you know, build up, which actually might be pretty fun. Now that Sugu is aware, all these different moments where in real life it's like, oh shit, is she about to find out or not, right? There could be a lot of fun that could be had with that. The roleplay voice, it's actually pretty fucking good. The posh roleplay voice from Leafa, dude, it's actually pretty good. And goddamn, the charisma hat, the lore just makes a fucking full comeback. I can't believe it's fucking back. I didn't think it was that important. I thought that, okay, it's just some random abridged lore that's been done with and never got mentioned in the game. But it's like, psych? It's Oberon's ultimate goal. It is what it is. All right, I think this is episode 14. So we have three more episodes left. And then after that, we're going to have to wait like a year for each episode because that's how long each episode comes out, bro.